It's been great uh, working hard, you know, trying to keep the legs fresh every day. That's a challenge. Um, I like the competition. It's nice to be in an open competition, you know, battling every day. Uh, waiting for that waiver has been a little, a little bit of anxiety there. Uh, trying to, you know, just keep my head up, keep it, keep competing every day. Um, I learned how to deal with a lot of adversity. Coming out of high school, they pushed you very hard to uh, hit your full potential. And being behind a guy like Quinn Sharp, who's probably going to be drafted this year, made me learn a lot about myself and kicking in general. It made me a much better player. And I'm just trying to get my confidence back. And sometimes I just won't reach out for the ball or something like that just because it's, it's a mind battle. I mean, I know it's 100%, but it's, it's all in your mind having the confidence to really stretch out and put, put all your body weight and torque on that. I mean, if you think about it, that's the way it is every time. You go out there in a game, I, I went through it in high school, if I miss a kick, I was <laughs> under the gun for the next two hours. So I, I, I love it, and you can't play this position if you don't love it. And you got to love the competition. And you think about it the way I see it, even if there wasn't anyone here in my competition, I'd be in competition with myself. So. You've always got to be looking for ways to be better, and so bringing someone else in, bringing, I mean, they brought three people in since I was here my freshman year, that's only a way for me to get better. And I know everyone at this level strives to be the best, but there's always going to be competition. Even if, even if you're the starter on your team, you're going to have to look at people on the other team as competition because you want to be the number one guy everywhere. So I love the competition, and I accept it like he said. Like Matt said, it's it's what you want. It's what you play the game for. Or if you didn't do this, you'd probably go. He's just he was just a great guy, and I'm, I've, obviously he broke all these records. And I'm not 100 percent sure I can do that, but everyone's gonna have to try. Me or Matt or whoever gets the job, we're gonna have to try for it. And he was a great guy too. Great great in the community. And whoever's next is just gonna have to match that. And there's huge shoes to fill because Coach Solish and Coach Haynes they all expect the same exact performance as Matt dealt out. So.